OK, so now we're going to get into some problems with elimination. Now, when solving a system of equations um, by elimination, what we're going to do is we're going to either add or subtract the equations. And sometimes we're going to have to multiply by a multiplier. But before, to determine if we need to multiply by a multiplier, we know we can use elimination um, right off the bat. One, when we have the same variable with the same coefficients. Now, we could apply substitution on, on each one of these, but we're going to work on practicing elimination. So I would say elimination is nice when we see that they have the same variable, have the exact same coefficient. And it doesn't matter if they're pos both positive or both negative. But you can see both of my x's both have a coefficient of positive 1. Now, when they have the same coefficient with the same sign, then what I'll do is I'm going to subtract the two equations. All right. So when you have two equations with the same variable, have the same coefficient with the same sign, you subtract the equations. And I'll see why that works. 1x minus 1x is 0x. 0 times x is 0. So we say that our x is now eliminated. 2y minus y leaves us with y equals 10 minus 6 is going to equal 4. Therefore, now we know the value of 4, or the value of y, which is 4. So now to find the value of x, I need to choose one of my equations, the top or the bottom, to find the value of x. And it doesn't matter which one you choose. If I say x plus 2 times 4 equals 10, or if I say x plus 4 equals 6. It doesn't matter which one you use. So you can see that x is going to equal 2. It doesn't matter if you choose the top equation or the bottom equation, x is going to equal 2. Therefore, our solution is x equals 2 and y equals 4. And we can prove that by plugging in 2 in for x and 4 in for y and making sure that is true for both equations. Well, 2 plus 4 is equal to 6. 2 times 4 is 8, plus 2 is 10. So it works for both equations. So therefore, ladies and gentlemen, that is our solution by using elimination. Thanks.